And what happens if the information put in a scalar wave is molecular poison? This is a great concern of ours. First of all, we don't recommend you do this. Not because it will cause a problem, but because we don't know for sure whether it will cause a problem or not. We don't know whether your body will absorb the information of the poison. The tests that we've done to now and the early reports back from people that have received spooky scalar and have experimented, experimented with molecular modulation suggest that your body seems to absorb what it needs. Things it doesn't need, like a poison, it doesn't absorb and the scalar field just transfers straight through the person. We don't know this is a fact. And so always on the side of caution, we recommend not to put a poison onto the receiver coil. 